Now, ladies and gentlemen, as of today, it is officially the start of the I Am Rio Major 75% off sale, where all capsules are going to be going from a dollar to around 20 to 25 cents, depending on where you're living in the world. This is, of course, for the base capsules and, of course, the autographs, which is going to be absolutely crazy. Just like every other major, we are here during the 75% off sale, where most people the past couple of weeks, let alone past month, didn't think this would happen. So this sale is going to be great, but also scary for maybe a lot of new investors and players into the game. It's also going to spark quite a few questions, and I'm going to be answering those in today's video. What should I invest into right now? What's the best way to profit? Should I sell older things to buy these? Capsules versus stickers for an investment? And should I craft more? And of course, some other things I'm going to touch on, like some market madness you'll most likely be seeing alongside all of this, where people are most likely going to sell older major stickers, older profitable things to unbox these, and of course, invest into these. And I'll also give my final predictions on where I see these capsules going in the next little while. If you guys are new to the channel make sure you hit the like button and of course subscribe and here's a quick word from our video sponsor skins monkey now today's video sponsor is of course skins monkey skins monkey is currently the easiest and also fastest way you can buy but most importantly trade your csgo skins all you have to do is make sure you have your trade link and on your first trade if you have a leftover balance it goes towards your current balance that can be used the next time you end up trading skins it has three ways you can inspect but most importantly has a very in-depth inspect feature that you can see corners on a karamit for an example you can't really see other wise unless you have the item in game. If you end up topping up your balance, make sure to use promo code MANDO to get up to a 35% deposit bonus and a free $5 on the first trade. So the very first thing I want to talk about is market madness and what's going to happen to older things and maybe some of your items that could be going down in price as we speak. So something you'll see at the very beginning of every sort of big update inside of CS is market madness. Just the past couple of weeks, we saw the huge meta change and map change where Dust2 got removed and you saw market madness with that. M4A4 went to the moon, and 4 a ss went down in price, Rio souvenir packages, that being for Dust2, and let alone every other Dust2 souvenir went to the moon, specifically the M4A4 Coalition went to $600 when just a couple days prior, it was around 80 on a place like Buff, and with this it's most likely to be the exact same. You're probably going to see older capsules from older majors, this being from Stockholm and Antwerp, maybe drop 30 to 40% off, which though everyone's going to be looking at Rio as the next big thing, because it's so cheap, might be profitable for the short term, you and maybe other people won't be noticing, is older things are going to be even more profitable then because they dipped in price. And that's an opportunity to go buy those older things while everyone's looking at this. And don't panic sell anything if you see anything go down in price that you have that's non-Rio. It'll eventually rebound. It might take a couple of weeks though. As it goes for investing anything into Rio as of this moment, this being capsules, autographs or not, stickers, and even sticker crafts themselves. For pure profit perspectives, I would personally wait. It's not really worth going into this right away. I think most likely this is going to be somewhat over invested into, but at the same time with everyone hating it, I can't see many people wanting to buy this. The most people I see buying this, in my personal opinion, are they going to be the silent majority, the people who don't really comment on YouTube videos, and that was kind of the same boat as we saw with Stockholm. This major sale is most likely going to last at least five weeks. You do have some time to make some pretty good decisions. Looking at the past, I would wait the next two to three days to see what's going to happen, let alone maybe even two weeks. You're going to see sticker crafts that were originally a one for one sticker craft now be a thousand for thousand because there's so many of these. They're going to become so cheap. If you have any of these from before, well, I forgot to inform you, those are going to be a fraction, if not 99% off from where you had them just at the time you bought them. The best way to profit from the beginning of this anyway, either open five or six of those and cut yourself off so you don't unbox a whole bunch of them. If you end up pulling something really good, sell that immediately on the market. That's with any sort of unboxing when something new comes out. And profiting from this is not really going to be possible at the beginning, at least for an investment, that's what you want to call. If you want something that's guaranteed, like I said earlier with the market madness, definitely just go into something that's older that is guaranteed. If this is something that's a pretty good looking skin, garbage looking skin, but holds their value, maybe that's even a sticker or capsule that's from a few years ago that's low in supply. And as it goes for capsules versus stickers, capsules and stickers are two completely different things, let alone this year, I would say are very different. Gold stickers for me are something that, that are completely different from just the regular base stickers. Like they normally are, but this time it's a very much bigger of a difference for me. I'm almost not even counting these gold stickers in the same ballpark as normal Rio stickers because they look so much different and so much better. With a regular Rio sticker, it just looks like a blob, but adding that black background just makes it look so much more clean and it's actually very craftable. I see a future for these, but this is just my personal opinion and it's obviously very, very early on to tell. Capsules have their pro and cons. You can buy a lot of them, of course, in a very short period of time. But the problem with that, other people are thinking the 
exact same thing and you'll most likely end up with an RMR situation unless you wait out the next few weeks. The mid-tier things with these may be things what people don't tell you. Capsules, let alone for something like this, they're not too craftable and I believe these are going to be hype driven to open kind of similar to how Stockholm and Antwerp have been performing on the market recently. And well, what I mean by that is whenever there's a major going on, for example, the Rio major when it happened, Stockholm and Antwerp went crazy up in price, the unboxings went up, listings got taken off of the market, and I feel the exact same thing is going to happen with Rio in the future, but to a shorter degree. And this is where we're going to wrap things up for the video, giving my personal opinion. So my personal opinion with these stickers, I don't think they're going to perform well. I think they're going to be underinvested by a long shot. That's just because they're very hard to craft with. And this is my biggest problem with them. They look good when you're inspecting them in game. Rarity looks pretty good as well. And same with the supply. But I think people are going to be blinded just like other things inside CS with supply on these. People are going to be like, oh, this is only 20 or maybe 100 of these on there on the market. People are going to try to unbox more, especially as the sales going on. But then people are going to come to terms with you can't really put these on any sort of weapon without them either ruining the weapon or making a garbage craft. And that's why I just don't really see people buying these in the future. And that's why I'm probably going to be sitting out of this one for a very large investment. Let me know what you guys think. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.